You're listening to Return to the Lord, a 40-day audio journey through the season of Lent. We pray that these readings and prayers will help you focus your personal prayer time. Lord, would you teach us from your word that we may humble ourselves before you and seek you with our whole hearts. Matthew chapter 26, verses 40 to 46. And he came to the disciples and found them sleeping. And he said to Peter, So, could you not watch with me one hour? Watch and pray that you may not enter into temptation. The spirit indeed is willing, but the flesh is weak. Again, for the second time, he went and prayed. My father, if this cannot pass unless I drink it, your will be done. And again he came and found them sleeping, for their eyes were heavy. So, leaving them again, he went away and prayed for the third time, saying the same words again. Then he came to the disciples and said to them, Sleep and take your rest later on. See, the hour is at hand, and the Son of Man is betrayed into the hands of sinners. Rise, let us be going. See, my betrayer is at hand. 1 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 13 No temptation has overtaken you that is not common to man. God is faithful, and he will not let you be tempted beyond your ability. But with the temptation, he will also provide a way of escape, that you may be able to endure it. 1 Peter 5, verses 8-11 to Be sober-minded. Be watchful. Your adversary, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion, seeking someone to devour. Resist him, firm in your faith, knowing that the same kinds of suffering are being experienced by your brotherhood throughout the world. And after you have suffered a little while, the God of all grace, who has called you to his eternal glory in Christ, will himself restore, confirm, strengthen, and establish you. To him be the dominion forever and ever. Amen. O Lord, to be diligent and keep watch with you would be the greatest joy. But though we are willing, our flesh is weak. We are not strong enough against the sorrow and disappointments, the fears and toilsome labor that bear down upon us. We really do want to be faithful, really. Thank you for your grace. Thank you for your strength. Thank you for your obedience. Thank you for your clear-eyed submission to our Father, even at the cost of betrayal. Amen. 